All right, hello, hello, hello. How y'all doing today? Good, you? Doing great, doing great, doing great. And how did we get here just now? What happened? You just came, you just came and asked us. Yeah, do an interview, right? Yeah, 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 yeah okay. So, um, how is your mental health? It's doing pretty good right now. Doing pretty good, okay. Why is that? Why am I doing pretty good? Why is that? You work therapy. Therapy. You said boxing. Say boxing? Yeah. Oh, you're a boxer? Oh, box, I'm a new boxer. You're yeah, right? a new boxer, okay. Yeah. Don't okay, play with her. Just go to new yeah. places to chill at. Coffee shops. Coffee shops. Find out new shit every day. Yeah. Hang out with our friends. Mmm, that's what's up, that's what's up, that's what's up. And how often do you guys practice self-care? Basically every day. Every day. Every day. Yeah. That's good. What's your self-care routine? Like in the morning? Right, yeah, anytime, yeah, anytime. Just in the yeah. morning. Just wake up, brush your teeth, take a shower. Dress up, make sure you look good before you get out of the house. Make sure you look good at the house. Okay. Give How about yourself you? a pep talk in the morning. Yeah. Positive. Mm -hmm. That's what it's supposed to be. That's what's up. Okay, okay. How often do you guys try new experiences? Basically, every week. Every week, we try week, to go yeah. somewhere new. Okay. Try something new. If we like it, then we come back. If not, then like that like try, new try new things okay so when you are trying to do things right how do you cope with the uncomfort how do you overcome that fear you just go for it you, so you push yourself and just go for you it just right accept it, yeah and see how comfortable you are with trying new things mm, okay i like that and how often are you guys centered you know you're not thinking about the future or the past you just centered in that moment in that new experience Enough, then you don't have to <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, that's what's up. And what are the benefits from trying a new experience, in your opinion? You get, you get to get out of your comfort zone. Get out of your comfort you zone. Yeah, try new. Okay, I like that. Okay, so we're gonna take everything that that we just learned, okay, and we're gonna try a new experience. Today we're gonna talk about the importance of foot care, okay, and basically how it helps you out mentally and physically. So. The reason why I chose foot care, right, is because your feet can gain and hold eternal energy, right? And by taking care of your feet right, you can spread that eternal energy throughout your body as medicine and balance yourself out. So, so, so y'all ready? Alright, first question. How do you guys feel about your feet? I love my feet. I love you, my feet. You love your feet. Okay, why is that? Because they take me everywhere. Take yeah. you, okay, get you from point A to point B, right? Okay, okay. I'm glad y'all said that. Comfortable shoes. How important is that? To, how important is it to have a comfortable shoe? Extremely important. Mm. Yeah. Why is it important? Because if you don't have comfortable shoes, then you wouldn't want to walk around, do anything. And, it, and if it's and not comfortable, you wouldn't be able to walk. Yeah. Mm. And uncomfortable shoes just makes you lazy and tired. Facts. So it basically affects your posture, right, and mood, stuff like that, right? Mm -hmm. yep. Okay. What is the most comfortable shoe to y'all? Oh, she got the air. Oh, she, okay, okay, okay. Any sneakers. Any sneakers? Yep, sneakers. Okay, that's good, that's good, that's good. Okay, another thing, right, is stretching. How often do you guys stretch your feet? Stretch? Yep, like a simple toe wiggle. Three times a week. Three times a week. Okay, now why is that? Why do you guys do that for? Because I have to go boxing. You go, okay. okay. How about you? Okay. So, <laughs> so basically, toe wiggling keeps your stain. Yeah, toe wiggling keeps your brain stimulated. Okay, get your positive thoughts in the mind. Right, makes you feel goofy. Right, stuff like that. Right. Okay. And um, how often do you guys simply just moisturize your feet? Like, yeah. Not every day. Every moisturize. Time you take a shower. Yeah, every shower. Yeah. Okay. Every shower. Okay. So basically, when you're moisturizing, right, you're rubbing your feet. You're basically helping that eternal energy spread throughout your legs, up to your, you know, stomach, abdomen, stuff like that, right? To your body, right? That medicine, right? And how often do you guys get pedicures and stuff like that? Every, every once in a while. Every, every once in a while. Weeks, yeah. Every two weeks, okay. And what does that pedicure do for y'all? What? I said, I said, and what does that pedicure do for y'all? It makes us feel good. Makes y'all feel clean, good. Yeah. Makes you feel clean. Okay, so basically a pedicure, right? It can increase your mental and physical confidence. It can tell you early signs of uh, of uh, health issues, and also it keeps that skin moisturized, right? right. It keeps it preserved, right? Stuff like that, right? So how y'all feeling about this interview so far? Feels great. Feels, yeah. Feels great. 
Good, good. Were the fouls do so far? Yep. All right, I'm going to ask you guys one more question, okay? Can y'all continue living the moment, okay? Step out of your comfort zone a little bit more and show the soles of your feet, the bottom of... Is that a question? Yeah. We didn't hear the question. What was the question? I was thinking... <laughs> 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 okay. All right, I was saying, can you guys live in the moment, right? Step out of your comfort zone a little bit more mm -hmm. and show us the soles of your feet, the bottom of your feet. The soul, the bottom, the soul. I wouldn't be down. No. You wouldn't be down. Okay. My feet on the internet. No, not the internet. Yeah. Oh, it's not. Why? Why is that? Why? Why is it not a good thing? A lot thing? of people out there. A lot of creeps out there. Okay. That's okay. Okay. Right, that's understandable. Okay. So after that question, right? How are you guys feeling about the interview now? It's it's good so far, but it's a bit it's creepy yeah, to me. Huh. Why is it a bit creepy to you? You're telling us to show you our feet. Maybe you're one of the creeps. Yeah, we don't know what you're gonna use it for. So. Really? Yeah. Maybe I'm one of the creeps. Yeah. <laughs> After all that, seriously, you still yeah. think? Maybe you, you just told us to show you our feet. The soles, right? Do you know why I said the soul though? You see how good we take care of them? How if you good take, they are? If you take care of your feet, right, you're gonna have a problem with showing them, right? That, that's why I try to show. Yeah, it's 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 less Take the foot fetish private, right? I don't really care about that part. It's all about just, you know, why you stick on your feet. But it's still a no, right? Okay, all right, good, okay, okay, okay. Uh, overall, how do you ask that question? Was it a positive interview overall? It is a positive. Yeah, positive. Yeah. All right, good, good, good. Well, right on. Thank you guys very much. Right on. Hello, hello, hello. How you doing? I'm good, how are you? Doing good, doing good. And how did we get here just now? What happened? What'd you say? <laughs> I, was, I was asking, how did we get here just now? What happened? <laughs> <laughs> you don't know. Oh, it's all good. So basically, today I want to talk to you about your mental health, right? Mental health, self care, and the points of foot care, right? Okay. So, how is your mental health, first of all? I'm pretty good. Pretty good. It's tired a little bit, but we. That's good. Take it as it goes. That's good. That's good. That's good. And how often do you practice self care? Oh, I do it actually every two weeks. Every two take weeks. Myself out, get my nails done. Get nails done. Take myself out to eat. Uh -huh. Hang out with friends. I actually, I mean. It really takes a lot to do that sometimes. Okay. Being a full time student. Yeah. But you know what? I prioritize my time to take care of myself. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Okay. I like that. I like that. How often do you try new experiences? Um, Once every month. Once every month? Yeah, because I barely have <laughs> yeah. time to be outside every day. I understand. Okay, right? Yeah. When you do try them, right? How do you cope with the uncomfort? What do you do? Uh, things that I don't feel uncomfortable with, it's, it's very rare for me to do it. It's very I, rare. I, I try to stay in my own zone where I feel comfortable zone. doing something. So wow, yeah. okay. What's the worst that can happen from trying that new experience in your opinion? Uh, I feel like I don't want to embarrass myself. You don't want to embarrass yourself. I know you yourself. can get embarrassed and you know that's how people learn, but yeah. it's just that I just don't feel comfortable. You don't feel comfortable. Oh, yeah. mm, okay, okay. And how often do you apply mindfulness? But basically, you just center. You're not thinking about the future or I the past. I think about the future. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I me. do think about what I'm going to do after college uh -huh. and all that. I think about where I want to be the next 10 years, mm, yeah. what I want to be doing. Yeah. So, yeah, it's something that I think about more and more as okay. I am growing up. I'm not getting young anymore. I'm yeah. getting old, of which. So I gotta think about what I'm gonna do in the yeah. next ten years, of which I'm before yeah. you. So yeah, yeah. so yeah. it kind of like affects a lot of things. Okay. So, yeah. How about simply just in the moment? Yeah, in the moment I do think yeah. so. Yeah, how the you? Okay, we, we, we're gonna try to apply mindfulness. We're gonna try to apply this interview, okay? <laughs> uh, so we're gonna take everything we just learn, right? And we're gonna try a new experience, okay? <laughs> All right, so we're going to talk about the importance of foot care. All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, ready? One, two, three. So first of all, how do you feel about your own feet? I feel comfortable. I feel confident about you my feet. You feel confident yes, about your feet? I do feel what? confident about it. Mm. Yeah. Why is that? Why do you feel confident about it? Because I, uh, I used to be embarrassed about my feet. Yeah. Really? Yeah, sometimes I'm like, oh, my feet is still big. But you know what? I was uh, like, you know what? That's how God made me. It's yeah. supposed to be like that. I can't. Mm. I can't change it. So, yeah. yeah. Okay. How you cope with that? I'm okay. I'm cool with it yeah. nowadays. I'm okay. I take everything as it is. Okay. When somebody insult me about it, yeah. I'm okay. I don't get offended because I've learned to accept it myself. Mm, okay. Yeah. Uh, how important is to wear a comfortable shoe in your opinion? 
Oh, it is very comfortable because uh, as for me, I went 12 hour shift yeah. on my feet. So wearing comfortable shoes is something I very, very let myself invest in. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Okay, I like that. So comfortable shoes affect your posture and move, right? Oh, yes. Okay. How often do you stretch your feet, wiggle your toes and stuff like that? Oh, uh, every day. Mm. I mean, every minute I get. Because I've been on my feet for 12 hours. So yeah. yeah. I cannot let myself feel comfortable, so yes. That's good. So toe wiggling, right? Stimulates your brain systems and keeping your feet moving. Helps you keep calm, right? But also keeps your feet more stronger, right? Yeah. Okay, how often do you get pedicures and stuff like that? Uh, pedicures every two weeks. Every two weeks. Yes. All right, okay. Mm -hmm. Is there a certain uh, pedicure that you get? Certain type of pedicure? Or no, is I just get a regular yeah. pedicure. Okay, so pedicures, yeah. so pedicures affect your uh, affect your confidence, right? Your mental and physical confidence. Yeah. It also tells you other signs to help issues and stuff like that, right? Yes. All right, so how are you feeling about the interview so far? Oh, pretty good. Pretty good? Yes, I liked it. You liked it? Okay, <laughs> Even right. though it's my first time being on camera. Okay. You know what? It was pretty amazing. Okay. Thank you for having me. All right, one well, well, last question. One well, last question we leave, all right? Okay. All right, um, can you step out your comfort zone a little bit more, right? And show the soles of your feet. I'm sorry, what you mean? Can you step out your comfort zone a little bit more and show us the soles of your feet? Oh, Just God. the soles. <laughs> can you stand right here? Can you stand on the floor right here? Oh, stand on the, yes, yes. Yeah, stay on the floor for me. You can't. Can you sit down for me right there on the floor? You want me to sit right yeah, here? Yeah, sit right there on the floor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah, perfect. Just take your shoes off for me. Oh, snap. Oh, God. All right, we're going to do this on camera here. All right. All right. Y'all can see. Yeah, you do take care of them, right? Yeah, I do. They ain't overly not that much dirt anywhere or anything like that. Yeah. Okay, we'll give you toes for me. How does that feel? Feels comfortable. So everybody out there, right? Yeah. She's stimulating them brain systems. She's making herself feel good, but she's also making her feet more stronger in the moment. So come your feet in for me. I know it's cold outside. My bad. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> My bad. I mean, catch you outside like this. So basically, when you scrunch your feet in like that, it's supposed to make it's supposed to make the bottom of your feet more stronger. I mean, more warmer. How does that feel? It feels good. All right, good, good, good. Okay, now you shake your feet for me. Shake them. It's like shake them out, right? You're taking away <laughs> that tension. All right, now stop and spread your toes for me. So toe spreading, right? That basically uh, helps out with your flexibility, right? With, with your balance and with the strength, right? Stuff like that, right? All right, can you see the other foot now? Okay. Yeah, just the other foot one more time here. Uh, All right. All right, put your feet on, on the shoe real quick. I'm gonna get the top of the foot here. All right, y'all can see. My nails are not done. Oh, it's all good, it's all good. So y'all can see, right? But your nails is clean, right? A lot of people don't understand, right? There's a lot of dirt that can build up under your nails if you don't clean them. That can cause fungus, right? Yeah. Okay. Put your put up for me. Put it up. Alright. Same thing, right? Clean foot. Clean. There ain't no calluses. There ain't no uh, dead skin nowhere, right? It's all important to take care of your feet, right? Alright. Well, that's it. Was it positive overall? Yeah, it was. Alright. Thank, so hey, thank you. <laughs>